Martian. What a beautiful day to play all together. <laughs> Look how many surprise eggs. <laughs> wow. This is too good to be true. Get the egg of the color we'll land on. But we have to be careful not to land on the one without a present. The Easter Bunny will show you. Spin the wheel. Oh no, it's going to land on the wrong one. Almost. It's on blue. I can't wait to see what's inside the first egg. It's a beautiful bow. It suits you. Come on, Groovy. It's your turn. I'm so excited to discover your color. Spin the wheel. Red, your favorite color. Okay, Groovy. We can practice later. Linda, it's your turn. Spin the wheel. Uh -oh. It landed on green. Wow, a transformer toy. Amazing. Yeah. It's James's turn. your turn. Good luck. Spin the wheel. Great! Orange. Wow! A rescue pet. When you wet it, it reveals its true shape. You don't like it? Uh-oh. Oh. What are you doing? You can't just take an egg. Come on, don't be afraid of the fortune wheel. Spin the wheel. Oh no, it landed on the wrong one. But don't be sad. You won't have a surprise egg, but you'll enjoy a delicious chocolate egg. And of course, friends share everything. Right, kids? Look, Groovy! An Easter egg! Mmm, delicious! Skeleton finger, where are you? Here I am. 
am, here I am, how do you do? Zombie fingers, zombie finger, where are you? Here I am, here I am, how do you do? Which finger, which finger, where are you? Here I am, here I am, how do you do? Vampire finger, vampire finger, where are you? Here I am, here I am, how do you do? Ghost finger, ghost finger, where are you? Here I am, here I am, how do you do? Beautiful day to play in the sandbox. <laughs> Groovy, that crab is so cute. Hmm, what smells so good? I'm sure it's something delicious. Watch out! Uh, broccoli! That's what smelled so good! No, Groovy, you have to wait until everyone is at the table. Why don't you go find Phoebe? Phoebe, lunch is ready! Hurry up, because Groovy is starving! Groovy, you have to help Phoebe get free. <laughs> I think that won't be enough. Hmm, I don't know if any of these transformations will work. Wait, yes, a shovel is just what we need. You can tell how hungry Groovy is by how he runs. What's wrong, Phoebe? Don't you like broccoli? Broccoli tastes great, right, Groovy? That's Phoebe's lunch. Phoebe, broccoli is really healthy. Don't you want to try it? I'm sure you're going to like it. Mm, Pops, help me explain to her how important it is to eat vegetables and fruits. Eating fruits and vegetables like broccoli is really important for our health. 
Fruits and veggies are our main source of nutrients to be strong and grow without stopping. We should eat five pieces of fruits and veggies a day. Groovy eats more than five. For sure. <laughs> and you kids, do you eat fruits and veggies daily? Phoebe, why won't you even try a little bit of this broccoli? Come on. If you only give it a chance, I'm sure you're going to love it. Right, kids? Oh, Phoebe can't keep cycling because she's starving. Of course you haven't eaten your veggies. Now you have no strength. Wow, Groovy! That broccoli made you super strong. Don't worry, Phoebe. We can fix it later. But now, how are we going to get back home? I know! Groovy can help us. Groovy, can you help us? What should Groovy transform into to bring Phoebe and her broken tricycle home? Into a bouquet of flowers? A mop? Or tow truck? That's it! Groovy should transform into a tow truck to get back home. All right, kids. With this super tow truck, we'll be home in a minute. Look, Groovy, today's your lucky day. There's veggies for dinner, too. I'm sorry, Phoebe. Come on, Phoebe, try it. Surely they're delicious. Daddy cooks really well. See? I'm not lying. Veggies are delicious. I can't believe it. <laughs> she liked them so much that she's also eaten Groovy's dinner. <laughs> Don't worry. Groovy, there's more for you. You can repeat veggies as many times as you want. How well have you eaten dinner? With all these veggies, you'll have energy to play non-stop. What a beautiful day to play in the garden. What's the matter, Phoebe? Tired of the ball already? Ah, you want to try Groovy Scooter. It's okay. Let's ask him if he'll let you have it for a while. Groovy! 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 <laughs> Hi, Groovy. Could you lend your scooter to Phoebe for a ride? Come on, she really wants to play with it for a while. That's it, Groovy. There's nothing better than knowing how to share with your friends. Wow, Phoebe has taken a liking to the scooter. Don't worry, Groovy. We are asking her to return it to you right now. Phoebe! 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 Now it's Groovy's turn to use the scooter. Phoebe, that's not done. You have to share your toys. It's Groovy's turn. Pops, please tell her yourself to see if she listens to you better.
Sharing toys with your friends is so much fun. But sharing doesn't only mean that they lend you their toys. You should lend them yours too. Don't be selfish. This way, both of you will win because you will have many more toys to play with together. Did you get that, Phoebe? Phoebe, that's not very nice. Ruby, you better play something else. How about some tea time with your little friends? I think Mr. Teddy wants a little more. What's the matter, Phoebe? Tired of the skateboard? Do you want to play tea party? You'll have to talk to Groovy first. You weren't very nice to him before. What, Groovy? Should we let Phoebe play? Run, Groovy! She's taking your guests! You're stuck in the treehouse now. Only Groovy can help you, but since you haven't been very nice to him, I don't know if he'll want to. What do we do, Groovy? Do we help her? Yeah, I know. Phoebe loves all of your toys and hasn't wanted to share them with you. But still, Phoebe's your friend, and that's the most important thing. Don't you think we should help her? Kids, what should Groovy transform into so Phoebe can get down from the tree? A boat? A shampoo bottle? Or a rescue mattress? Yes, into a mattress! Come on, Phoebe. You just have to jump. Good. Where's Phoebe? Where is she? Ah, there she is. Phoebe, don't you think Groovy deserves an apology? I'm glad to see you two finally playing together. There's nothing more fun than sharing games and toys with friends. Right, Mr. Teddy? <laughs> Welcome to Groovy the Martian Costume Show. As judges, we have Miss Phoebe, Mr. Fluffy, Sir Honey. We can't wait to see what costumes you're going to surprise us with, Groovy. Ready? Wow, Groovy. <laughs> what a cool witch. Let's see what score the judges have for you. Hmm, we have a three, a five, and a zero? Wow, honey comes stomping, Groovy. Let's continue with the second costume of the night.
<laughs> Groovy. I think you made a mess with frozen characters. Let's see what our judges say. Groovy, we didn't increase the score. Third and last chance. Do you have any super costume in mind? Wow, it's amazing! The judges love it! All of them! Hi, friends! Are you ready for a new educational tip? Today, we're learning to help the environment saving water! We all brush our teeth several times a day. Or at least we should do it. And sometimes, while we are brushing them, we leave the tap running. We waste lots and lots of water this way. So listen, everybody. Just by turning off the water while we brush our teeth, we can save lots of water. That's how it's done, kids. After every meal, we should brush our teeth, but without wasting any water. This way, we're saving the environment together. See you next time. Daddy, daddy. Yes, Vivi. Trash. 
cardboard goes in the cardboard bin. The cardboard goes in the cardboard bin. The cardboard goes in the cardboard bin. Let's recycle the trash. Beautiful day to learn in school. And what are you learning today? Ah, the basic emotions. Pops, shall we go over them again? Joyful, when a big smile is drawn on our faces. <laughs> Sad, if we can't help crying. Fearful, when we open our eyes and mouth wide. Scared. <laughs> Angry, if we frown and pout. <laughs> Thanks, Pops. Children, did you learn them? Very, very well. Great, then. The task for tomorrow is to bring a picture of every emotion learned today. Joyful, sad, fearful, and angry. The garden is a good place to take pictures, don't you think, kids? Great choice, Phoebe. The photo will have a beautiful background. 
Hey Groovy, you are finally going to fulfill your dream of being a model. Pose for us. <laughs> All right, now pretend you're super happy. Hey, you don't look really happy. Let's try better with sadness. Come on, Groovy. Hmm, it's going to be more difficult than I thought. Pops has an idea to make the photos work. Provoke Groovy's emotions, but shh, it's better that Groovy doesn't know. What a scary pose, Groovy. Perfect picture. You already have one emotion, fear. Let's continue with the next one. Hmm. That broccoli looks great. How happy Groovy is. Oh no, it wasn't for you, Groovy. You're so sad. Great, two emotions and one to go. Joy and sadness. We only have one left to complete the album. Oh no, the camera is broken. There is the missing emotion, anger. What a pity that we can't take a picture of Phoebe, but what about a drawing? Yes, you can draw anger in the album directly. What's the matter? Don't you have something to draw with? I see. Groovy, can you help us? Children, what should Groovy transform into to draw on the album? A pearl necklace? A marker? Or a rugby ball? Yes, into a marker. Great. It's fantastic, Phoebe. The album is full. Homework done. You can play now. Oh, an A+. Plus. That's really something to be cheerful about, kids. Let's see those smiles. Cheer up, Groovy. You'll end up doing it well. What a beautiful day to play with all these toys. Groovy, watch out! Ha 
<laughs> what a crash! Oh, what's wrong with Phoebe? Kids, could you tell me? How does Phoebe feel? Joyful? Fearful? Angry? Or sad? That's it. Phoebe is sad. Nice try. Oh, Phoebe must be very sad not to laugh with you. Groovy, it's okay if Phoebe's sad. Emotions aren't bad. They help us to know what we are feeling. We need to find out why Phoebe's sad. What's the matter, Phoebe? Why are you sad? Oh no, Snuggles is gone. Now we understand why Phoebe feels so sad. Snuggles is her pet, and she loves him very much. Wait a minute, but Snuggles always leaves for a while. But you're worried because he hasn't come back yet. How long has he been gone? Don't worry, Phoebe. We're going to help you find him. Phoebe, have you looked around already? And the rest of the garden? Yes, the garden is very big and Snuggles is very small. We need help to find him quickly. Groovy, can you help us? Children, what should Groovy transform into to find Snuggles? A toy truck? A helicopter? Or a slipper? Exactly! Into a helicopter! Great! are. He's stuck in the fence. Oh, so much love. How beautiful. I love stories with a happy ending. Phoebe has gone from being sad to joyful thanks to our friendship. Yay! Ha <laughs> ha, <laughs> <laughs> Snuggles is having a great time. And Groovy too! What a beautiful day to enjoy breakfast. All right, kids, you ate it all. Now it's time to brush your teeth. Mm -hmm. 
Phoebe, you can play with the ball later. Now you have to brush your teeth. It's very important to keep them clean. Right, Pops? <laughs> to have clean and healthy teeth, you have to brush your teeth after every meal. In other words, you have to brush your teeth after breakfast, lunch, and dinner. Children, what have you just done? Indeed, you had breakfast. So what's next? No, Groovy, no yoga. After breakfast, we have to brush our teeth. Come on, what are you waiting for? All right, kids, let's brush our teeth. What do we need first? That's right, Phoebe, a toothbrush. And the second thing we need? <laughs> Groovy, what a crazy idea. Soap is for hands. Teeth are washed with toothpaste. That's better. Slow down, slow down, Groovy. You don't need so much. Wait a minute. Are you sure you know how to brush your teeth? What if Pops helps us to see how it's done? Please, little gentleman, smile. You should brush your teeth and gums in circles gently, just like Pops does. You don't only have to brush the teeth that are in sight, but also those that are more hidden, ahead and behind, all of them. You must take your time. Two minutes is recommended, understood? After you have brushed them all, rinse your mouth. Let's see, Groovy. you have the cleanest teeth in the whole galaxy. Phoebe, it's your turn. Practice what we've learned today. Phoebe, not so fast. Those teeth are still dirty. You haven't washed them enough. They're full of bacteria. You think they're clean because we can't see the bacterias with the naked eye. But I assure you, your teeth are full of the little monsters. Groovy, will you help me show them? Children, what should Groovy transform into to see Phoebe's teeth closer? A pearl necklace? A magnifying glass? We're in a shower. Exactly. Into a magnifying glass. Wonderful. There they are. Ready to eat your teeth, Phoebe. <laughs> Goodbye, little monsters. Bye! All right. Good job, kids. You're done with them. Now your teeth are fresh, healthy, and clean.
brush your teeth after every meal. Yeah, I don't want to. Ouch! Cabbage germs on your teeth, on your teeth, on your teeth. Cabbage germs on your teeth. They love sweets and. But, you see, <laughs> your nose is missing. Where is my nose? I just don't know. Can't find my nose. Where is my nose? Without my nose, I'm indisposed. Can't smell a rose or foot all door. Is that my nose? Let's try that nose. Them. Happy 
Happy Mother's Day! <laughs> oh! Okay, we'll distract her. La, 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 la. Superhero. Being a real superhero would be fun. Groovy, do you think we could play real superheroes? Whoa! Super Phoebe to the rescue! And what's going to be the Super Phoebe's first mission? That's right, to help someone in need. Hmm, seems like somebody needs help. <laughs> Pops has a great idea. Let's go on an adventure.
eyes? Oh, there you are. Well, don't worry, children. We'll get a new ice cream for you. There. Phoebe, you don't need powers to be a real superhero. Hi, Phoebe. Oh, and hi, Groovy. Wow, what are you going to build? A tree house. Whoa, so fun. It's looking great. Groovy, you are the best. Do you know what would be fun? Paint it with beautiful colors. So cute! Is this house already finished? Can you show it to us? Ta-da! Uh-oh, kids! Our tree house isn't over a tree! But I know Groovy can help us! Groovy! Transform into a crane. Perfect. Are we invited to your super treehouse, kids? Nice! And what's the password? Wow! Those fresh fruit ice creams look really good! Delicious! Mmm! Phoebe's ice cream has two strawberry balls and groovies! One, two, three, four, Five balls of different fruit! So greedy! Be careful, Groovy! Oh, too bad! <laughs> Groovy, it's not the wave's fault! Groovy, that's Phoebe's ice cream! She has to decide if she wants to share it with you or not! Very good, Phoebe. You should always share with your friends. Now you can both enjoy your fresh and healthy ice cream. Mmm. Nom. And now, keep enjoying the beach with friends. What a beautiful day for... Play? Children, 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 do you think this is the way to play inside the house? 
Hey, listen to me. You must pick up the toys before your parents come. can't be that messy. You have to pick it up. Mm -hmm. hmm. You have five minutes to pick up the room. You can't go to lunch until you do. I know you're hungry, but the rules are the rules. The house must be tidy. Children, don't be angry. Cleaning up doesn't have to be boring. Right, Pops? We can clean up as a game. We're going to have a competition. Whoever puts the most toys in the trunk wins. What do you think, children? Do you want to play? Do you accept the challenge? Let the competition begin. Come on, hurry up. The one who picks up the most toys wins. Haha, <laughs> but Groovy, where are you going with that? <laughs> Groovy, that's not a toy. Alright children, it's all wrapped up. Did you have fun? Congratulations, Phoebe, you won! You can go eat now! Groovy, can you help her? <laughs> Children, what should Groovy transform into to keep Phoebe from crashing? A diamond? An air mattress? Or a strawberry? Yes, on a mattress! Great! Groovy, you saved Phoebe from a good hit. <laughs> Groovy, look how you finally tied the score. You're both the best at picking up the room. Haha, <laughs> Groovy, you must be starving. Your stomach is growling so loudly. Come on, it's time for lunch. That's what I call having an appetite, because playing makes you very hungry. Remember, children, after using your toys, always, always pick them up. What a beautiful day to play with the family in the garden. Well, well, looks like Mom and Dad don't feel like playing ball very much. Well, 
maybe we can go out and play a little later. Oh no, it's gone dark and they're still on the couch. Pops, why don't you explain to them that they shouldn't spend so much time looking at screens? We must use... Hello? They don't even listen to us, do they? Why don't you try with Groovy first? How? With a little something he can't resist. help pops I think guys it's time to take action up to? What are you going to transform? Kids, what should Groovy transform into so Phoebe and her parents have to give up their phones? A chair? A puzzle piece? Or a loud alarm? That's it. An alarm. Let's do it. technology responsibly. It's very useful for the development of many skills and access to information, but it's very easy to become absorbed and end up wasting a lot of time. Today, we lost a great afternoon of playing in the sunshine together in the garden. Not only children should learn this, it is very important that parents set an example. Did you get that, kids? And parents? Idea, Pops. It's late to go out in the garden, but we can play a board game. <laughs> this is really playtime and family. Wow, Booby, your hippo doesn't swallow. It must be stuffed. Hey, that's cheating. <laughs> Little friends, as you can see, nothing can replace family fun. Turn off your cell phones. Turn on your imagination. What a beautiful day to be at home enjoying family and... Presents! Merry Christmas, children! <laughs> C. 
someone's knocking at the door. Will it be Santa Claus? <laughs> it's not Santa. It's your cousin, Boo Boo. He came for a visit with Auntie. Good. Now you can all play together, sharing your new gifts with Boo Boo. What are you waiting for? Offer him a present. You have plenty of them. Children, children, sharing is good. Pops, you better help me explain to them why it's good to share. This boy has left home without a jacket or a coat. He is very, very cold. However, this one has come out with a very warm clothes. He's even hot. The warm child might not help the child who is cold, but he knows that just by lending him a couple of clothes, he will stop being cold and he will continue being warm. Sharing is good because neither of them will get cold. Very well, Groovy. I see that you have understood. Sharing is good because then you can all play. Now it's your turn, Phoebe. Share a gift with Boo Boo. Phoebe, remember, we have to share. Don't worry, he's not going to break it. Come on, Phoebe, lend your toy for a while to your cousin. Oh no! Somebody do something! <laughs> nice try, Groovy! But we'll need something else! Well done, Groovy! It worked! Look out, Phoebe! The tree! Phoebe, the plane doesn't move. I think you should ask your friends to help get it out of the tree. Will you guys help us get the plane? Children, what should Groovy transform into to get the plane back from the top of the tree? Into a frog? A glass of water? Or a ladder? That's it. Into a ladder. Wonderful! That's the way I like it. Phoebe, you've learned the most important thing about sharing, making someone else happy. Kids, we wish you a Merry Christmas with sharing lots of gifts and games with your family and friends. What a beautiful day to go to the beach. Haha, <laughs> I love how you use the beach wraps, Groovy. I'm glad you're wearing white clothes. It's important not to get dressed in warm clothes in summer. It's the hottest season and the sun heats up a lot. Hmm, the cooler is too close to the sea. What do you think, kids? Is it a good place to leave it? Oh, 
Are you going to play paddle ball? What a great idea. Ruby, do you know how to play? Sure. Groovy, you have to hit it with the paddle. Exactly, with that one. It's your turn to start. Really good, Groovy. We found your sport. Wow, Phoebe, you're getting sunburnt. Haven't you used any sunscreen? Phoebe, you have to use sunscreen, always. It's essential not to get burnt. And you too, Groovy, even if you don't get sunburnt easily. Pops, help me explain to them what else they have to do to protect themselves from the sun. In summer, the sun heats up a lot. Every time you go to the beach, the swimming pool, or the park, you have to follow this not to get sunburnt. 1. Use sunscreen several times during the day. 2. Use caps or hats. 3. Protect your eyes with sunglasses. And 4. Stay in the shade during the hottest hours. For example, under the umbrella. Have you understood? Very good. Put on sunscreen all over your body. Perfect! Now we need something to cover your head. Great! And what else? Bright, cool sunglasses! You're ready to keep playing! Groovy, what's wrong? Oh no, the waves stole the cooler with our snacks inside. Oh, uh, the, the sea is dragging it further and further away. I knew Groovy. Our fridge has our favorite snack. Fresh summer fruit. Watermelon, nectarine, melon. We have to get it back. Hmm, what can we do? I know, Groovy can help us. Kids, what should Groovy transform into to get the fridge back? A camera? A paddle boat? Or a ball? Really good! Into a paddle boat! Come on, Phoebe, you can do it. You're doing it great. Less is left. Keep moving. Very good. Watch out, a wave. Yay, it's already yours. Now to the beach. Good, you've done it, kids. Now, snack time! Under the umbrella, you can enjoy your snack without getting sunburned. The fresh fruit is the best to recharge your batteries. Isn't it good?